Hi guys, today we will be talking about the purple pet bed and reviewing it and hopefully get some footage of my dog's first impressions. Now, this is the third pet bed I have purchased since we adopted this dog. Um, he really, really loves the slumpy, dirty bed <laughs> and he's so used to it. So hopefully third time is a charm. I've tried two other beds, pet beds, from two other companies that I work with. Um, he always rejected them. So let's see what's different about the purple pet bed and is it really going to be different and is he gonna like it? I haven't opened it yet so I'm gonna open it and I'm expecting probably the same um, material, you know, purple famous polymer, um, hyper elastic material. So let's see what's inside the box. This purple pet bag comes in three different sizes, small, medium, and large. And obviously, of course, three different price ranges according to the size of the pet bag you'll be purchasing. I have here the medium one. Um, I'm thinking it's a little too big for my dog, and I think the small is too small, so we went with the medium. The large probably is really for Saint Bernard or something, <laughs> really big, because the medium looks big already. Okay, let me figure out the top. Okay, obviously this is the top, and that's the bottom. It has a zipper, so we're going to unzip it. Let's see. Okay. It's supposed to be a clean one and stays clean, unlike other uh, pet beds, traditional ones. Um, okay, and it should stay cool. I don't know if pets care about cool or not, but <laughs> it's, it's cool to find out that it keeps your pet cool. It's breathable material and washable cover. I will be washing this cover also. I will be putting this pet bed into the test, just like I test my mattresses. All right, wishing back with my pet though. He's really stubborn and freaks out when there's something new like a pet bed. Okay, we are going to unzip it. Let's see what's inside. I like the color. I have to say, I really, really like the color. Gray and purple. Okay. Unzipping, let me go any further than that. Nope, it stops right here and here. So this is it. It has instructions and steps on how to wash it. And dry it will dry without heat. So do not bleach. And it came from Utah. It took a while for this bed to come, by the way. We placed it only a few weeks ago, like really long time ago. I can't remember, but I can go back to my um, order, purchase order. But it showed up today, so that's as good. Um, okay, now you have to wash it. Oh, okay, I like this. It's um, easy clean or wipe off, um, so that's good, I guess. Oh man, I'm about to find out. All right, so that's how it looks like. This is it. You remove the cover. You can wash it. It's washable. You can even just um, maybe with some soap or paper towel or just water and paper towel. You can wipe it off. So I'm gonna try everything. Um, you know what? Let's just cut it open and show you what's inside. Am I going to see powder again, guys? Oh my gosh, that powder. I can't even say the word powder. The whole word is against me. <laughs> hey, it's all good. There is powder, so do not freak out, okay? And my pet is going to be fine if he accepts this bed, so. Uh, yeah. I mean, again, I really, really firmly believe that this powder is here for a purpose, to keep this polymer separated, and it's not too sticky and lumpy. So, come on. It's there for a purpose. I don't care. I've been sleeping on my purple mattress for a long time now, and I still have it. I didn't give it away. And by the way, I purchased this bed, bed. So, 
It wasn't censored by purple or anything. Okay, so that's how it looks like. It's basically a piece of their mattress. <laughs> kind of. I mean, it's the mattress. So when you're done with your purple mattress, all you have to do is just cut a piece out and make it your own new pet bed. If you have a cat, a dog, a turtle, look at that. I mean, I can even have uh, my daughter sleep on it if my dog doesn't want it. So it's really cool for sleepovers, for little people. <laughs> oh my gosh, so many ideas with this pet bed. It's just, just a pet bed. It's little people bed. It's even probably inside the mystery, honestly. <laughs> and that's crazy, but I'm little. Hey, look at that. I can, I can have a sleepover with my pet on his pet bed. Isn't that awesome? I'm oh, seriously. Okay, so this aside, <laughs> this reminds me of a purple mattress, just like that. Okay, all right, now, wish me luck. I'm gonna see if my dog's gonna like it. <sighs> Maybe I'll put just some bacon or something on it, see what happens. All right, stick around. Again, so cool that you get to share this bed with your pet. I can't get over it. <laughs> it's awesome. Okay, so with the Casper bed or bed bed, um, Ryder was forced kind of to sit on it, uh, but he didn't like it. He ran away. The nest bedding bed, bed bed was not that awesome. Also, he didn't really like it much. Um, but that's what we have today purple pet bath that we're going to put to the test by Ryder. I will follow up with you guys on my blog and let you know and update you um, how Ryder is reacting or how is he liking his new purple pet bath. He's half on it and half on the carpet. <laughs> Again, because I think he has no other way out or no way out. <laughs> but I don't know. I hope he doesn't feel so tortured, like forced to be doing this. Do you like that, Ryder? Hey, Ryder. Oh, okay. The tail is kind of wagging. It's good. I really want him to start getting used to something new. And if he doesn't like it, and we're going on a road trip or something, he doesn't need to use it. We will use it. Seriously. Right? Because it's almost a purple mattress. It's a purple mattress. By the way, this is um, this one is more expensive than any other pet that we have invested in or we have tried out there on the market. You will see all the price things um, on our blog. All right, stay tuned or come back for follow up, and we will update you and let you know about Rider. 
journey and this purple.